Philly fingers here, playing one pocket. First player to sink eight balls into their pocket wins the game. Most players would start off with a safety break, but if you can reliably control your break and sink a ball into your pocket, you will get that point. Keep in mind, if you sink any balls into the opposite corner, the opponent will get those points. So trust in your break. The person breaking can choose either of the two pockets below. Now, let's use the second ball break. The idea here is to hit the second ball with a little bit of a stun shot so that we can bank the corner ball off the rail into the right bottom corner pocket. Now any balls that are pocketed into any other pockets will be spotted after your turn is completed. I will now attempt a combo to the bottom right and move the cue into the middle of the table to break up that cluster. I will now hit this ball with just a touch of top right. I want to come off the rail and back to the middle so that I can disturb that cluster and open them up. This ball I will now hit with bottom right so I can come up the center of the table. I want to be on this side of the table so I can have easy access to the remaining balls. I now line up and just do a little bit of a short draw. I only want to come back a tiny bit. The reason I want to stay here is because as I walk around I have an easy bank shot. When I bank this ball, I'm going to go bottom right so that I can disturb the cluster but at the same time land on the proper side of the table. Now all my shots are in front of me. I will now aim this shot into the corner and stun over to the rail. This leads me straight in on my final shot. So all I have to do is hit this with a little bit of draw and not too hard. And that completes the game. Eight balls pocketed into one pocket. Till next time.